We are on top of Tim Jones Peak, which is the second of the three Seymour Peaks on Vancouver's North Shore, which is the unceded territory of the Coast Salish people, including the Squamish, Tsleil-Waututh, and Musqueam nations. And I have with me a harmonica. If you missed the story as to how I came to have this harmonica, you can actually catch the entire video on my Bagger Challenge experience, peak bagging, North Shore hiking adventures. You can actually fast forward right to the spot on the video where it says Bagger Challenge 2020 results. That's how I got this and it has never been taken out of this box. So I'm going to now, for the very first time, take this harmonica out of this box. It's got nice little paper on it. And um, so I posted how I got it and asked if I should learn how to play it. Not one person has said no. And I've had a few people who have said I really need to learn how to play harmonica. So we're going to give this a go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. So clearly I'm going to need to invest in some, at least some time into some harmonica lessons so I can actually learn how to play the thing. But that little burst of um, attempt was kind of fun. Um, so stay tuned as I learn more and try again on the summit of the next peak. We are on top of Mount Strawn today. It is Friday. Last time we were out on a Monday, so we're, what, four days later? I can count. And Strawn is on, of course, Vancouver's North Shore, which is the unceded territories of the Coast Salish people, including the Squamish, tsleil and Musqueam Nations. And I have my harmonica again. And since Monday, I've managed to watch some YouTube videos on how to play harmonica, but because I'm really worried about my neighbors upstairs, I really didn't want to practice at home. And the guy in the video is like, yeah, so you should practice this like 10 minutes a day every day for a couple weeks and then you'll start to get it and I haven't done that um, but we're just gonna you know practice for the first time now so I'm gonna you know we learned about like how to hold it and pucker technique and looking for like there's like a four hole yeah but that's not a good one mm -hmm. So I haven't quite mastered how to do a scale yet, but that wasn't bad for a first go. Could you at least tell I was trying to do a scale? No response. Oh, God, it was awful. <laughs> and apparently it was awful. I brought my professional hecklers and clearly I'm not paying them enough. Um, oh, but there was a song, like if we really want to embarrass me even more, there was this song that I have not memorized at all, but um, we'll see if I can fake it and this would be really good for laughs and we'll see if Laura and Laws can guess what song it's supposed to be. <laughs> that would be a good one to learn. Yeah, that would be a really good one to learn, but I didn't learn it. Um, okay, so we're going to go. Okay, that wasn't good. We'll try that one more time. <laughs> And my nose is running. Yum. What's that? <laughs> Not quite. Okay, let's see if, if the next one clues you in on what it is. Hang on. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Not even close. Oh, 
putting up with that. I have footage from 85 Peaks in Vancouver's North Shore. I will be doing more mountain musicals, videos about specific peaks, about gear, about anything to do with mountain adventures. So if you like this, please like this video and subscribe to my channel and maybe I'll even learn how to play harmonica. I think that's, that's a wrap. That's, that is my harmonica for the day. <laughs>